Hello, and welcome to another episode of the Steam Free to Play. We're back in our Stormcrow, continuing to grind sea bills for our next mech. But we're spawning here on Tourmaline Desert. We're just going to go immediately to our right to regroup with our team. Get a little bit out in the open here on this spawn. Just got to watch your left side and see if anyone pokes up here. If they do, give them a taste of that long range lasers. But it looks like we got away scot free. All right. So, what to talk about for today's episode? There is actually a couple things. First is there is a Christmas event happening this weekend. I'm not sure of the details right off the top of my head, but it's similar to a lot of events that um, the game puts on every so often. You'll have your different uh, sort of achievements or challenges, like win so many skirmish matches, win so many assault matches, and then they'll have different rewards to them. So those are definitely something I'm going to be capitalizing on in this free-to-play series as it gives me additional money and resources that I can get for free. Acquired. We got an opponent there. Give him a little bit of large pulse laser. And get up in here into cover. Now it looks like the enemy's pushing that right flank hard, so we're gonna push a little out. Give this guy a taste of it. And looks like we need to double back here. No? Where are the opponents? They're over on our right side. Okay, yeah, I'm going to go over and help our allies over here. Because it looks like the opponents are all up in the acquired. F7 area. New target acquired. Ooh. There's that griffin that jumped down. Help out with him. A couple opponents disconnected. That's That's never good for either team, because ah, I always like to have a fair fight. Ooh, guy out there. I see the UAV. Take it down, hopefully. We gotta prevent them from getting that information on our team. Target acquired. And I'm going to flank around hard right Target here. Acquired. Try to get up and shoot at these guys from another angle. Oh, that urban mech's coming down. Its leg is low. Try to take off its leg, and it gets taken out by an ally. Excellent. Moving this way into cover. Now I can start working this ridge, moving around to the right. New target acquired. Take a shot at that raven. And since he's the first enemy I see, I'm just going to work on him. No need to go further around where more enemies can see me. Since I'm really hot, I'm just going to use my large pulse until I cool down a bit. And plus, I'm spotting for all these long-range missiles. Darwolf coming, Darwolf coming, get the hell away. But I did pick up that kill. Although I, I picked up the kill, but I did trade a, a very strong hit for it. But that's okay. Took that guy out with some nice, calm firing for the CT. Alright, also another thing that happened was, as I'm fighting an Orion 2C here, is the 2C Battle Mechs, Acquired. the clan versions of some IS chassis, have just been released in, in a patch that happened uh, just yesterday. Gotta keep moving, but we're 8 1. We're gonna win this match. Another shot to him. So, yeah, I got on my main account, I got the whole 2C package. And we win. And they're awesome mechs. Um, definitely. I haven't played the Jenner yet, but the Orion is so nice in terms of how I like to play mechs. It's got a good mix of combat ability and mobility, but for this match we got 169,000 sea bills and more experience. And we did well. But on to the next match. Reactor online.
What is this? Another Tourmaline skirmish? It's like we were just here. Yes, we were. But that's the same map. That's fine with me. I actually like this map. And I will apologize slightly. It seems my voice is a little hoarse. I was listening to myself after that last game and I was like, oh. <laughs> Sounds like I got a frog in my throat, so apologize for that. But continuing talking about the 2C Battle Max that came out. Oh, they are awesome. They are the combination of clan technology and inner sphere customization. So you can choose whether or not to have your Endo and Pharaoh, unlike what you can do now with the Omnipods and the Omnimex, like the Stormcrow I'm driving, where you can't choose which ones you have. Uh, thankfully, the Stormcrow has both of them. But also on the 2C Mex, you can have a dynamic slots. So if you put on Endo and Pharaoh, you could put on a piece of equipment and it would move the Endo and Pharaoh slots away from that location so that you could fit that piece of equipment, which is amazing to have. And that's one reason why you can sort of optimize uh, IS mechs a little bit more than clan mechs. That was, yeah, it was a little hot there. But yeah, I, I love them. I think they're a perfect storm. Like the, uh, the Orion just works for me. And I really feel like it's what the Orion could be if it wasn't held back by its current um, hitboxes and inner sphere XL engines. But, oh well. I have my 2C now to play, and I can play that in my clan drop decks in Community Warfare on my main account, which makes me happy. But for now, we're just holding this position. Delta six. And watching the opponents. It looks like they might be hanging on our left. So let us move over to our left to try to assist. Got a shot in there. Acquired. Shot in here. Yeah, we're gonna need to move to our left. This is a fairly common tactic for the group here to go through here. So we'll move over this way. Let's see if we can intercept. Hold down this front. Move up to this next piece of cover. I am sort of committing myself to this opening though. So we shall see. We'll sort of top scrape along here. Get a shot into that Timby. Another shot in. Fall back and let's cool down a bit. Another good shot. He's open CT. We got SRMs right here. <clears throat> and we'll come around. New target acquired. And we've got a catapult. New target acquired. New target acquired. Another good hit on that centurion. Warning incoming. Incoming missiles. Dodge them. Yeah, we definitely need more allies here on the left. New target acquired. Let's work on this direwolf. He's not looking at me, so I can put in some good shots into his CT. Level critical. <laughs> I, he overheated, I overheated. It's all good. But now to get out of here. I'm just going to run, and I'm going to rotate my torso as I'm running. Try to spread the damage out as much as possible. Get one more shot into him, and then cr go around the corner. And then we'll reset back here and try to do a one more scrape here out and a little bit more damage before we skedaddle completely. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I am getting something in my throat. Hopefully I don't get sick. That would suck. Acquired. 
So rebase right here in good cover. And that dire wolf will come around that corner. And I'll get another good shot into him before we move on. More than one guy there. Missiles, missiles, missiles. Continuing to retreat. Head up through here. So his opponent's coming from D6. D6. And now I have my... Um, New target acquired. <laughs> I've got my uh, voice chat enabled. I actually can New talk to people. Acquired. Get a really good hit into that shadow cat there. One more good hit. And that target side is gone coming. and he is down from my ally. Excellent. That direwolf is CT crit. So if you guys push, oh, excellent! Takes him out. <clears throat> Target acquired. Nice good drain onto that New catapult. And onto that adder. If he pokes again, he's dead. There's an enemy up on our left here. It's a Timberwolf I cored out earlier. It's also that Centurion. I'm not worried about incoming missiles because missiles suck. I'll get this Centurion for the last thing I do. One more good laser burn. Ah, he put it into his arm. But we are now up on kills. We are winning. I take him down. Excellent. And last is that Adder. And we take him down with that shot. Good game to our opponents. Let's see how we did. 172,000 C bills, and we got an achievement. Excellent. And we did quite well. 673 damage. Second only to it in the salts. Excellent. One more game for the end of this video. Reactor online. And last Sensors match online. for this video, Weapons we're in Frozen online. City Night, which is a very nice All map. Nice and cold for my lasers, and nice and clear too. You can see a far ways away. Ugh. So I was planning on doing multiple recordings today and then um, uploading them over the next well uploading them all at once and then just setting them to release uh, every day or two days for the next few the next like week but man you gotta let me know if this voice is, is is okay or not I think I might just wait a couple days for my my voice to recover from whatever sickness I'm slowly fighting off and then I will continue to <laughs> make videos because you don't want to have a groggy voice, I, at least I assume. But we've taken Kappa, we'll push forward here. Target got acquired. opponent in the tunnel, our Firestarter versus a Nova, hopefully he can win that. Because I'm not in any space to assist. New target got acquired. opponents in the lower area. Pushing on Theta, oh, this guy. Take a good hit for him. See, that was an extra. He, he's doing something wrong here. He's facing me and not twisting at all when I shoot. And that was causing it to allow me to do massive damage to one component. New target acquired. Lots of oh, quad fives. Oh, God. Those kind of king crabs hurt as hell. New target acquired. Target destroyed. And Target let us acquired. see here. Ooh. That Centurion. Target destroyed. Took it down. And I get the kill most damage dealt. Which completely justified. Target acquired. 
good hit there on that timby and let's push down this way take another hit in the timby before we switch okay. off to somebody else oh that crap I hate those crabs. They're so scary with their quad fives. Get, the, get out of this guy's line of sight. So we don't have incoming missile. Uh, well. New target he gets acquired. a lock on us somehow. We are down a guy. Which sucks. It seems like there's a really big fight down at Theta. I don't really want to drop down there. It takes a while to get back up, and I'd rather keep pressuring the guys up here. Ugh. All right, let's. New target oh. acquired. Hi. Take a good hit in that guy's rear. Oh no, incoming missiles. Ah, and it's, oh, I got caught out with this goddamn thing. Oh well, can't have all the games be well. Let's see here. Oh. Oh, we got some derp on our team. Oh, that's okay. Let's see here. Things are actually fairly equal. I just got caught out badly by that uh, king crab. Let us see what our allies are doing. So it looks like they're down in the theta area. They are pushing around. Oh, catching this guy either disconnected or um, AFK, and they're pushing back up to flank around. Oh, what's this fire starter? He looks like he's having fun. Our, ooh, what's this guy? Switch over to one of the people fighting this catapult. It's the guy that missled me a whole bunch. I'd like to see him die. Ah, you're doing it wrong, Timberwolf. You're pushing out and exposing yourself to those guys on the ridge. You should have stayed back behind and just fired on the catapult. And now you're you're taking the damage for it. Yeah, this guy's doing it right. He's coming out, seeing one at a time, and then attacking. Although, a little bit too far there. The Evan Jaguar could see him. Let's see here. Oh, it's still three for three. It's a close game. We got our Centurion. A Wolfhound. And a Firestarter. And we shall see which team can clinch it. It's actually all the people from my Lance are remaining. <laughs> Minus me. Ooh, you might want to stay together, guys. Shoot him! Don't overheat. Yes, good job. It's still two for two, but the opponents are getting caps on us. But I believe the opponents are quite slow comparatively. Uh, I think the king crab is left. Oh, no, there's king crab. He died. So... Who is left? I believe an Ebon Jaguar and something else. So is possible to outcap them because you have more mobility. But it's a little it's 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 close, this match. We're getting Theta. We need to get other points, if not kill them. Man, it's, it's suspenseful. Where are the opponents? 
we'll take this time when we're watching these mechs. To, oh, just go uncap Sigma, you silly person. Um, one last thing that happened on my channel is I just passed a thousand subscribers, and that is ridiculous. There's a thousand people out there that want to hear what I say. That's really cool. So yeah, I was thinking you might do, I don't know, a special Why video. And I don't know, maybe do some special video or a giveaway or something. And yeah, this fire starter is not really playing the game mode. Well, hmm, don't want that to be the last, no, that can't be the last, that wasn't satisfying. I need to have a satisfying game to end this video, so let's do one more. That was <laughs> not satisfying at all with the ally running around like that. So one more match. Alright, now the true last match of this video. On... River City, an assault match. There we go. Now we're getting off towards the opponents. So yeah, hit a thousand subscribers. I want to do something. Maybe. A video, some kind. I'm not sure what people would want to see of a 1,000 subscriber special sort of thing. I don't know. Maybe I can get a... a a mech pack or something and give it away. Uh, not anything huge. Probably just like a one of the unseen sort of thing. But eh, I don't know. I'll figure something out in the next few days and talk about it on the next free to play episode. Not we're just grouping back up with our team and push forward a little bit into the edge of the city here. And we'll just get some sight lines and see if we can take some pot shots at the opponents. And boom, into cover. If you are new, please, when you're shooting at a target, hit the R button and lock them up. It really helps those of us that have target no acquired. Take a shot there. Back into cover. Incoming missiles. Incoming missiles, I don't care. Buildings are OP. Poked out there once. I'll poke out there one more time. New target acquired. I'm gonna hold that as long as I can. Lost it. Ooh, there's an opponent on the right. There. Target acquired. But buildings are far too OP. So hard to defeat buildings with lerms, considering the buildings are invincible. Will not get in this guy's way. And we'll take his position if he doesn't want it. This is the position that I wanted to start with. New target acquired. Nice hit in there. To do. Let's see what to do. You're kind of stepping out there is kind of dangerous now that everyone's firing along that edge. So let's not step out there. Let us um, get out of this situation. Let's go around to our left. Oh, that Jenner. Uh, pop up in here. I couldn't see the opponent there very well. It's a little hard in the dark, especially with the shiny, shiny laser beams. Let's get a hit onto that guy. Incoming missiles. Can't do anything to me. I have got a building. 
shot in on executioner. Oh, Ultra twos, interesting build. Ultra twos are not something I would recommend. Oh, a little bit of a frame drop when it switches to daytime lighting for some reason. There's another hit on the executioner. I am kind of half tempted to get super aggressive here, but I feel like it would be pretty stupid. They're moving around that side. Okay, let's go over there to intercept. We're not going to head directly at them. We're going to take a right here and head more back into these buildings so we can have some good cover. And we're going to go around this fuel tank here. Now, are they out in the water? New target acquired. That is a good question. Get a shot at that ember. I gotta go check to see if they're in the water or not. Yeah, they're up there. Missiles should only be a few. Oh, get the hell out of here. So they're coming around G3 in the water. Let's keep running here. Get into cover. Reset. Get back. New target acquired. Got a really good hit on that Jenner 2C. New target acquired. There's the arrow just standing there. Enemy oh, shoot again, shoot again, shoot again. Good damage on that arrow. He's going to take out here in a moment. Good. Our spotting of those guys on the right has moved our team in. There's this Black Knight coming in. You get a good angle on him. Try to get, weave it through these buildings. It's, gosh, this is difficult. Oh, there's an enemy acquired. there. Oh, God damn it. There. Good shot. Alright, step forward here. Enemy base is being captured. We are not winning the f <laughs> Kind of winning the fight. We have to assume we're already down one because we have an ally off capturing the base. That guy's basically Enemy base neutered. Is there, he's he's neutered. He's only got a single medium laser left. He's not worth firing upon. He's not worth the heat. We'll weave our way back through the buildings here and reset. They're going to be trying to push onto our base here soon. So we'll reset back to here. Step out. New target acquired. Base, Base is under attack. attack. Warning incoming missile. I'm not sure where those missiles came from. New that guy. Acquired. That's where the missiles came from. There. Base is being captured. Scared him off. Target acquired. Enemy base is being Ally walked captured. in front of me. I had to move my crosshairs off but my allies are pushing into the base here and I will assist them base is being captured. We took down that critical. executioner New target acquired. Enemy base is being captured. took out that guy's hunch that's the majority of his weapons base, captured. New target acquired. took out that guy critical. Base is pretty much secured. Took out that guy. Overheated for it, but that was worth. And now we just have that long range missile guy out in the water. Excellent. I don't want that guy to steal my kill. New target acquired. Warning incoming missile. Critical. Break line of sight. Enemy base is being captured. Warning incoming missile. 
destroyed. Direct fire will always win against Lurms at this range. So, if you're going to play Lurms, you got to play him correctly. And that guy definitely was not standing out in the open like that. Picked up that. Have on Jaguar. And the last person dies. And we win the game. That's a good one to end on. Oh, we've got a fistful of sea bills. We'll take a look at that achievement. 284,000 sea bills. Oh, excellent. Five kills, three assists, 791 damage. Excellent. Exit out of there, and we get our cadet bonus when we connect back up to the mech lab. And also, we'll take a look at the uh, achievement that is a fistful of sea bills. Connect, connect, ever so slow. Once this connects, we'll look down here in the bottom left. Uh, come on. There we go. We're at 4.275 million sea bills right now. So we're on our way to getting the 12 or so we need for our next strong crow. We're about, uh, if I can do. If I can do some math, we're about a third of the way there. <laughs> uh, achievements, and let's see. A fistful of sea bills, when we earn 2 million from regular play. This is not the sea bills that you earn from your cadet bonus, because obviously we've gotten way more than that. But, yeah, we can see in total how many we've earned in the, our entirety of our account here, which is, this achievement is a good way to keep track of it, up until 250 mil, and then you're the 1%, and this doesn't track anymore. But, this will be our, our way of seeing how far we've come. But for now, our Stormcrow seems to be doing just wonderfully. We are halfway through Tier 4, and thank you for watching this episode of the Steam Free-to-Play. Good hunting.